Hello everyone, you are on the Nelfabi channel. What do you know about current trends in the cryptocurrency world? Today, the entire crypto segment is acquiring a new perspective of interaction with users, which is expressed in the development of GameFi. GameFi is a mix of decentralized finance and NFT gaming. In this new industry, games are based on the play to earn model. These games reward users not only with impressions, but also with tokens and interesting game mechanics. Now millions of people spend time in virtual world and receive tokens for this. In this regard, I would like to tell you about Infinity Craft, a project with a great future. Infinity Craft is an Infinity game meta-universe operating on a chain of polygons. Infinity Craft's economics model is based on the groove of Ethereum. Infinity Craft entices you to play as dwarves and collect in-game red tokens until Ethereum reaches a certain price. Gnomes can be upgraded to increase their value and red extension efficiency. Rewards are awarded at the end of the game based on the player's share of total red earnings. As you play, you can also earn money by upgrading and reselling infities. Infinity Craft is the Polygon blockchain gaming metaverse money game launched this fail. All Infinity objects here are 100% supported by Ethereum. By the way, a mod of guests and competition was recently added, the price in which is a trophy Infinity or a good amount of USDT. There are five types of gnomes and five types is islands, common, upcommon, epic, legendary. The less often an island is found, the more shining ons on it in relation to the price of the island. If you spend one matic, then the number of radiance of this island will be from 1 to 2. If you choose a regular island, then it can contain from 0.5 to 1 radiant. The higher the class of the dwarf, the stronger it is and the more radiant the dwarf can receive with greater speed. The strongest dwarf with the most powerful pumping can dig up 100% of the island. The dwarf can be upgraded. The upgrade level of the dwarf is limited by its main level. Trade, energy and pickaxe are integral parameters on the sum of which the total trade of the dwarf depends. The project's team also has an early 3D desktop version running on the Unity game engine. A mobile version for Android and iOS is under development. Now we have only a demo version with free game balance available. You can pay the demo for free. Every player who successfully completes the demo is awarded an Infinity reward that is of real value and can be played in other versions to earn a share of the Ethereum funds. A demo version of the game is available on the official website. You just need to go to the required section, connect your wallet, select gnomes and islands and start digging them in search of Radiant and other resources. Remember that in this game there are different strategies for pumping gnomes, temporary and powerful with the help of rubies, and permanent and average with the help of the shining or virtual dollar. The more you pump your gnomes, the faster he will extract resources. Infinity Craft welcomes all new users and will be happy to add a section on their rewards to their tokenomics. It is important to note that the referral program is already under development and will be announced on the official channels of the project in the near future. Today we all have the opportunity to earn on the groove of Ethereum and Infinity, test Infinity Craft games and also win prizes in USDT and Infinity in regular player competitions. If you are interested in this project, then you can participate in the closed round of token sale. To do this, just go to the site and fill out the required form. Infinity Craft is an interesting project that is definitely worth getting to know personally. All the necessary links can be found in the description under the video. You were on the Nelfabit channel. Thanks for watching.